often lead to phony results. Just about ready and racing now in the Madigan's Jockey Club stakes as they break away and they're going two to one the field, two to one Tickenham on starting and Tickenham one of the first to show uh, but now being taken back in second place as Sacrament goes on under Walter Swinburne as they cover the first furlong and race uh, through the running gap which breaks up the Devil's Dyke here. They'll soon be turning right-handed and face up to the Heath and it's Sacrament with now Wayne County racing freely. Tickenham towards the outside can't get any cover at the moment. Time Star is fourth towards the inside and then back behind those is Al Riffer and then towards the rear only Royale the mayor demoting Garden of Heaven to last place. Nine furlongs in front of them, Flat Heath and it's Sacrament doing the donkey work by a half length to Wayne County in the light blue visor in second place at 35 miles per hour. Sacrament bowling along merrily from Wayne County second in the blue and yellow jacket. The dark green next on the inside is Time Star and then the favorite Tickenan in white with a green hoop under Cash Asmussen, a couple of lengths to Al Riffer in the headgear, orange and brown in black, and then the inside only Royale. And last still is Garden of Heaven there, number six. Heading down inside the final seven furlongs now, and Sacrament, the pace appears to be increasing by a length and a half of this leader to Wayne County and Time Star. Tickenden is handy in fourth place, and they're followed by only Royale tucked away from Al Riffer, and still Garden of Heaven is tail end Charlie. Down towards the final five and a half furlongs, and Sacrament trying to make all the running here still out in front by a length the time star is nicely poised Tickenden is next in fourth have they gone fast enough for the favorite I wonder Al Riffer nearest the camera in fifth and then back to the light blue of only Royale and Garden of Heaven has never been out of last place heading down to the final half mile here's Graham Good in the grandstand and the rank outside of Wayne County is still there. Here comes Tickenham now. Riffer scratching up on the outside to come and join Sacrament. With Time Star coming through next to the rails and travelling strongly, they've got to under three to go. On the left, Time Star just edging into the lead. Here goes Tickenham in the white jacket. Between the pair is Sacrament, who's rallying. On the extreme right in the light blue uh, comes only Royale. Further right in the visors, Al Riffer as they race down to the dip. Just over a furlong to go. And it's only Royale who's come from last to come and take Tickenham. With Sacrament back in third. Tickenham and only Royale do battle as they come inside the final furlong. And it's only Royale in the blue colours who asserts. Tickenham digging deep and tries to find more. Only Royale and Tickenham head for head they go to the line. It's only Royale who takes it. Only Royale, Tickenham the 1-2, Time Star and Sacrament the 3-4. They're now Riffer in front of the two outside of Garden of Heaven and Wayne County who was last of all. And so the result then of this, the Madigan's Jockey Club stakes. It's gone to horse number four, only Royale at 4-1. In the colours of Mr. Frank Stonach, trained here at Newmarket by Luca Kumani and bred at the Barrettstown Stud. Ridden by Frankie de Tori, so he is very much the man in form here today. Second horse home is number one, Tickenden, in the colours of Mr. George Strawbridge, trained in France by Jonathan Pease and ridden.